35 for Julio. Wearing number one, Davi Diaz. Wearing number two, Jordan King. Wearing number five, Aiden Cabrera. Wearing number 10, Sean Rivera.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. We are live and coming to you live tonight from beautiful Pope Francis here in the heart of Springfield. It is basketball night, and it is the Cardinals and the Knights doing battle round two of the Western Mass Tournament. We are proud to present it to you live exclusively on Pope Prep. AJ Gonzalez, the voice of the Cardinals, alongside with you all night long, along with the future voice of the Cardinals, Dom Percy. Dom, how are you? It has been a long time since we've had you on. I'm doing good. It's been a very nice winter break for me. Very nice winter break for both these teams coming hot off two wins for first round Western Mass. Hoyo coming off an 88-78 win first round versus Chickabee Comp. Let me tell you, Don Percy, the energy in this building tonight is palpable. The Cardinals and the Knights coming in here. Winner advancing to the final. They will take on the winner of the Aguam Central game tomorrow so that will be Aguam Central Holyoke Pope Francis those two winners will meet in the final on Saturday it is going to be a lot of fun with you all night we'll be breaking down this matchup lots of fun Holyoke Pope Francis Holyoke trying to get going inside trying to fire for two and one Jamil Rodriguez getting it to go and he'll have the end one opportunity to hear from the pay. So Jamil Rodriguez will have the opportunity. Under the Cardinal section, we get a little bit loud for this one. Three-point play, kept it in for him. No, he can't cash in. So no crowd noise is even needed there. Jamil Rodriguez couldn't bring it home. Vita Veli moves it around now. It's Jackson Mauer. Mauer holding in, trying to make a play. He's got it. Now we're looking inside. Vito back out to Mayfield. Sam Mayfield looking for two. It's a slam dunk on his head, on his head. Say it's Sam Mayfield, 2-2. Two, two. We are even Steven on Pope Prep. Cardinals looking for defense now. The Holyoke Knights trying to take it in the other way. Knights have the ball. 2-2 two, two game, first quarter. Energy in this building is loud. Holyoke fans have packed this place. Here's Davi Diaz trying to take it to the paint immediately, but he is rejected by Sam Mayfield. Cardinals will take it the other way now. They've got Jackson Mauer. Now we're inside Anderson's pass, picked off. Here come the Knights, trying to take it the other way, but what a stellar play by Ryan Mitavelli on the defensive side. Right now at this point, it is standing room only in here. I think we have just hit capacity for how much this building can take. We've got people lined up all over the gym for this exciting game tonight on Pope Prep. Davi Diaz moving to the round. Holyoke, nice ball movement, trying to fire from downtown. Tried to make it look easy, but they didn't. Rebound was taken in by Jackson Edwards. Cardinals moving it up fast. It's Reed, TJ for two, can't get it to go. Mayfield with the tip, he'll look around, and Holyoke will take it the other way off the steal. Trying to go for the alley-oop, did they put it in? No, Cardinals will take it the other way. It's Reed, TJ looking up the floor. Sam Mayfield puts it on his head, and that will get the Cardinals into this game. It is 4-2 for Pope Francis. Holyoke now will try to take it the other way. This game started out flying tonight on Pope Prep. Holyoke looking in for two points, but they are rejected. It's Sam Mayfield playing huge right now for the Pope Francis Cardinals. Wow, what energy right now. This is going crazy. The Both fan bases are into it, and let me tell you, this is great basketball. The atmosphere here is absolutely crazy. I mean, we're right next to each other. I can barely hear you yep. how loud the crowd is. <laughs> We got a, a, we got a shot to each other. here today. Yep. Mauer looking over. He's got Vita Veli. Here's Ryan Vito, the ginger ninja, trying to take it to the paint for two. But he is, in fact, rejected. Holyoke trying to take it the other way now. They've got possession and space. 5-19 to go in the opening quarter. Flying along tonight on Poe Prep, are we? They're going to try to fire from three. That'll be a rim. Rebound taken in by Edwards. He'll feed it up to Vito. Ryan Vitavelli out to Mauer. Mauer from downtown. Can't hit. Rebound Edwards. Edwards puts it in and gets it. Taco. Jackson Edwards thundering in the paint. That's two points for him. That's six for the Cardinals. It's a 6 2 game. Cardinals looking for defense now. Diaz looking inside, trying to make a play. Holyoke trying to get going in the paint. But again, it is Sam Mayfield getting up on defense. Cardinals will take it the other way. Vito looking around. That was a kick ball. It'll be Pope possession coming in. 4.43 to go in this opening quarter. Cardinals up by four. Again, folks, a reminder to like this content and subscribe to our channel. We're producing the finest and unique content anywhere on the high school sports scene. So no matter where you are and however you may be listening, we thank you for tuning in. It's Jackson Mauer who has it here for Pope. Over to the round, Mayfield, back out to Edwards. Jackson Edwards over to T.J. Reed. T.J. Reed, the captain, 22 away from 1,000. Here's Reed. 
Reed looking around. Reed going to take it to the paint. Just float it up in the air. That's good. He's 20 away from 1,000 now. TJ gets it to go. It is an 8-2 Pope Francis lead. Holyoke looking to take it the other way now. They've got possession. Looking inside, trying to fire for two. They do just that. Putting it in there for Holyoke was none other than Aiden Cabrera. Cabrera gets it to go for two. It's an 8-4 game. TJ Reed for Pope. Moving it around. He's got Mayfield. Sam Mayfield over to Ryan Vitavelli. Vito looking around, 3.53 to go in the quarter. Vito steps into the paint, trying to get it to go. He can't. Cardinal fans wanted the foul. They're not going to get it. Holyoke's trying to take it the other way. Moving in. Oh, shake and bake through Jackson Edwards, and he will be heading to the line. Sean Rivera. Ankle breaker and a half there from him. He is heading to the line. He'll shoot two. First one's going to be good for him. He earned it. My ankles are hurting all the way over here after that shake and bake. 8-5 basketball game right now. Trying to make it 8-6. Cardinals going to try to take it the other way. A reminder, folks, like this content. Subscribe to our channel, producing the finest unique content anywhere on the high school sports team. Vita Belli trying to move it in, and we have a foul. That'll be the first team foul on Holyoke of the evening. Pub section here tonight and loud in black. A.J. Gonsalves here with you in the doubleheader. We had boys hockey today this afternoon. It was a 3-1 win for the boys. Last game of their regular season. Next time we'll see them will be in the state tournament. Mayfield looking inside. Trying to stuff it in for two. Trying to get it to roll. He doesn't. Holyoke will take it the other way now with the Cardinals up two. 3.20 to go in the opening quarter. Cardinals trying to get there looking for defense as Mauer. I think the Cardinals wanted to travel, and they are going to get it. Traveling violation on Holyoke, and the Cards will move it down the floor. Here's Vito Velli. Ryan Vito moving it over. TJ Reed's got it. Here's Reed. Reed looking around, trying to create space. Reed for two. No, he doesn't get it to go. Rebound taken in by Holyoke. They've got to get back on defense. Holyoke trying to make a play all around the floor. They'll stop on a dime. That's a travel. It's going the way of Pope. 2.58 to go in the opening quarter. We've got an 8-6 ball game. Reed has it for Pope. He'll stop on a dime. T.J. Reed now 20 away from 1,000. Mayfield looking over. He's got a man. Mauer, Mauer, back to Vito. Over to Jackson Edwards it goes. Edwards with a little dribble. Finding it right back. Sam Mayfield, step back jumper. Doesn't hit. And the rebound is taken in by Holyoke. Holyoke working it quickly into the Cardinal end. At the top of the key. They'll move it around. Nice ball movement from the Purple Knights. Holyoke in the purple and white tonight. Going to try to fire from three, and they hit. Yes, they certainly do. I believe that was Jordan King for Holyoke, and the Knights have the lead. 9-8 on Pope Prep. Edwards moving to the round. He's got Mauer. Jackson Mauer kicking back. T.J. Reed's got it. Reed looking for an outlet, trying to create some space. Reed's going to fire from downtown. He can't hit. Rebound. Jackson Edwards was looking forward in the paint and couldn't come away with it. Now the Holyoke Knights will try to take it the other way. Looking for two is Davi Diaz, but Diaz comes up short. Cardinals going to take it the other way now. Vita Velli, the ginger ninja, trying to do it a little better. Finds Reed in the corner. TJ's wide open for three, and we have a timeout for Pope Francis. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll step aside. Cardinals have the lead early, 11-9. Stay tuned. Champs play here. Back in a flash. Live on Pope Prep coming up next. Lots of fun basketball tonight only on Pope Prep.
Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Don Percy, give me your thoughts on what you've seen thus far in the opening quarter. I, we've seen great for, great for great performance from both sides. A lot of back and forth basketball. Close game so far, only keeping it within two, a point or two, either way. What's mainly going to come down to the final moments of this game, mistakes, capitalization on mistakes, pressure, the want, all of it. Holyoke taking it in right for two, and they slam right over Ryan Vitavelli. Cardinals will look for a response. We've got a tie ball game on our hands. Vitavelli moves it around. He's got Edwards. Jackson Edwards trying to do something, but it's a traveling violation. Official did not like what he saw. Roof is about to explode in here. We are completely sold out at this point. It is standing room only right now. Holyoke will look for some space the other way, trying to get their offense going. Trying to make a play here in the latter stages of this opening quarter. Davi Diaz. Diaz kicking it out right near me. Trying to fire from three. It's Holyoke. They can't hit. Rebound taken in by Pope Francis. Reed has it. Here's TJ. Now 17 away from 1,000. Mayfield moves it around. He's got it. Mayfield over to Vito Velli. Ryan Vito loses it, but Edwards picks it right up. Edwards looking for Mayfield. That heads out of bounds. It'll be Holyoke ball. First quarter, 43.3 seconds to go. 11-11 tie. Winner of this game advances to the final on Saturday. Agwam and Central will be playing tomorrow. Winner of that game will take on the winner of this game. And Holyoke, they want it. They want it maybe a little bit more. It's Jamil Rodriguez putting it in for two. It's a 13-11 game. Reed has it. TJ Reed, Colin Shots, quarterback in the offense here for Pope. Reed looking around. Oh, the handles. TJ Reed for two, and he does it with authority, and he's talking trash. You gotta love it. Reed makes it a 13 13 game. Holy Oak Knights and Davi Diaz trying to take the lead. They can't. Rebound goes just out. A shot won't count. That's the end of the first quarter. We've hit triple zeros. Eight down. A lot more to go. Exclusively on Pope Prep. Champions play here. Stay tuned. Lots more fun coming up next exclusively on the Pope Prep YouTube channel. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We are ready to begin this second quarter. Lots of fun. Round two, Western Mass Tournament. Pope Francis and Holyoke doing battle live exclusively on Pope Prep. Holyoke looking around now. They've got it. Trying to create some space here are the Holyoke Knights. Nice ball movement from them. Shot clock at 20. Lots of time for Holyoke to plot and think things over here in a 13-13 ball game. Slugfest on Pope Prep. Holyoke trying to go with the backhand and in, and they can't. Sam Mayfield will look for it, and we got a whistle. Heads out of bounds. I believe Mayfield's right foot was out of bounds. That's a close call. I mean, really. It came right down to it. I mean, it was an inch out. I mean, really, it was that close. The referee did not like what he saw, and eventually it will be Holyoke possession here. 13-13 tie, second quarter. Holyoke Knights, nice ball movement from them. Looking around, it's their man Diaz. Diaz has it, trying to fire from three before we can go to Diaz. We've got a whistle. Cardinals will inbound now. Vitavelli. Ryan Vitavelli over to Mauer. 
Jackson Mauer looking inside, trying to fire for two. He gets it to go. Jackson Mauer putting it in for two points. It's a 15-13 game. Holyoke Knights working it up the floor now. They've got it. Looking around, trying to create some space. Standing room in here only. They'll try to fire for two. They can't get it to go. That'll be an offensive foul. Or are they just going to, I think it's a defensive foul. Excuse me, rather. Yeah, so Sam Mayfield's going to get accredited for the foul. Which means the Holyoke Knights are going to head to the stripe. Pope section will try to do their best imitation to keep him from getting points. I think it worked out for him. Sean Lavera at the line here for Holyoke. We go one for two, does Mr. Rivera. And we'll cut it back to a one point. Pope Francis lead. Ryan Vita Valley holds it in. 6.48 to go in the opening half. 15 14 slugfest on Pope Prep. Reed has it. Here's Vita Valley. Ryan Vito looking around, trying to create space. Reed, TJ inside. Sam Mayfield trying to get it going. Before we get anything else, we've got a whistle. It's going to be a jump ball. That'll be Pope Possession. Sorry, folks, I believe that was in the way of our shot clock somehow, some way. Cardinals will look around now. Reed's got it. Here's TJ. TJ trying to make a play here, but the pass is picked off. Here comes Holio trying to take it the other way. They put it in for two. It's a 16-15 game just like that. Sean Rivera gets it to go. T.J. Reed looking around now. 6.08 to go in the corner. Vitavelli's got it. The Ginger Ninja kicking it back to Tafari. King Tafari looking around. Jackson Edwards. Edwards back around. Ryan Vito's got it again. Shot clock at 14. Vito trying to call his shot right here. Back to Tremel it goes. Here's O.T. And that is going to be a traveling violation. Owen Tremel, the promising junior. It's called with a traveling violation. That'll get the Holyoke Knights fans into it. Tell him he can't do that. And now the Holy Oak Knights will try to take it the other way. They've got possession here. Looking around. Nice ball movement from them. Sean Rivera looking for an outlet. Trying to find any help he can get. He does in the form of Cabrera. And Cabrera can't put it in. That could have been goaltending all day long. Holy Oak fans can't believe it. Cardinals still looking for a rejection. But eventually it's Holy Oak who are able to put it in. That's two points for them. It's a 16-15 Holy Oak lead. Or excuse me, rather 18-15 now. Cardinals trying to take it the other way. They need points around this possession. Reed has it. TJ Reed. Looking around, he's got Terrell. Here's Owen Terrell. Back over to Jackson Edwards. Edwards, looking for space. Reed, looking for a travel with the Holyoke fans. They might get possession back here. And before we get anything else, we've got a foul called on the floor. Holyoke looking around now, taking it up center court. Sorry about the camera difficulties here, folks. They're figuring it out on the fly. Cardinals trying to get there, trying to make the play. Holyoke trying to fire from three. They can't hit deep into the Cardinal line. That's a fight for it in the paint. It'll go out of bounds. It'll be Holyoke possession still with 4.43 to go in the second corner. And Jordan D'Alessio will be coming in on the floor for Pope Francis. The freshman will get some court time here for the Cardinals. And Sam Mayfield will take a seat. Holyoke Knights trying to take it in and get a play going here. Up 18-15, but it's a steal from Ryan Vitabelli deep into his own end. Vito looking back. Reed trying to fire from three. It's an air ball, and it's going to head out of bounds, and the Holyoke fans are going to give him a run for his money. Boy, oh boy, 18-15 game. Lots of tension here on Pope Prep. Cardinals will look for it. The Holyoke Knights have it. Knights trying to make a play. Nice ball movement from Holyoke. They're trying to make a play here, trying to fire from deep. Can't hit. Now TJ Reed will take it. Here's Reed. Reed looking around, trying to create space. 408 to go. In the second corner. Delesio holding in. Delesio over to Reed. 
TJ Reed around center court, taking it to the top of the key, trying to move into the paint. He'll fire from two. He can't hit. Rebound heads all the way to the right side. Galesio tried to play it in. Eventually went out of bounds. It'll be Holyoke ball. Jackson now are getting ready to come back in. He will. He's going to sub off for TJ Reed. So Reed's going to come off. Jackson Mauer will hop on the floor. Cardinals looking for it. Holyoke has it. Holyoke moving to the round now, trying to shake and bake, trying to fire from downtown. They can hit. Rebound taken in by Pope Francis. Cardinals trying to make a play. Delesio up the floor to Edwards. Edwards to Mauer. Jackson Mauer holding it. Delesio. Delesio to Mauer. Anderson. Garrett Anderson trying to fight for two. And that will be a foul. 25 to go, second quarter. 18-15 ball game here on Pope Prep. Anderson at the line. First free throw will be good for him. Second free throw. For Anderson at the stripe, 18-16 the lead, now 18-17. Thanks to Garrett Anderson. Again, folks, apologize about our camera difficulties. We're figuring it out here on the fly. Not sure what is going on. Again, what a game for it to mess out, too. I mean, really. Round two, Western Mass Tournament. With a chance to go to the final. I mean, perfect timing from our camera. 3.09 to go. And this second quarter, Cardinals looking for space. Holyoke trying to get there, trying to make a play. So are the Cardinals, so the head out of bounds. It'll be Holyoke possession deep into the Cardinal territory. An inbound coming in momentarily for them with 3.02 to go now in this second quarter. Inbound coming in here, Holyoke trying to make a play at Diaz, trying to fire from three. He can't hit. Rebound, Cardinals trying to get there, trying to make a play on the defensive side. Holyoke still trying to put it in, and they do. Holyoke Knights get it to go. Just like that, that'll be a 2017 game. Knights up three now. Cardinals could use a bucket here. Ryan Vitavelli looking around, he's got it. Vito over to the corner, the Mauer. Jackson Mauer looking for it, trying to fire him from three. That is going to be an air ball. Holyoke trying to take it the other way. They've got possession. Up three, trying to add on against the Cardinals. It's Diaz trying to fire it for two. He can't hit. Rebound, take it in. Sam Mayfield. We'll move it up. It's Jackson Mauer. Mauer looking around now. Mauer looking in. He's got Vito. Vito trying to fire a little step back jumper. Can't hit it. And the rebound will head out of bounds. There for the Cardinals to get. It'll be Pope possession coming in momentarily. Holyoke up three on the Cardinals. Points have been tough to come by tonight for both sides. Mayfield holding it in. There's Sam Mayfield, the big man for Pope. Mayfield looking around, what a spin around, I'm trying to fire for two, he couldn't hit. Rebound taken in by Vito though. Vito will get it to go, and one. Ryan Vitavelli, the ginger ninja, getting it done for the Pope. Opportunity to tie with a free throw here. Jackson Edwards getting ready to hop on the floor too. Ryan Vitavelli trying to hit the free throw, he misses. How rare is that? Ryan Vitavelli doesn't hit a free throw? Man, oh man, what a rare occurrence. Holyoke trying to fire him from three. Can't hit. Rebound taken in by Holyoke, but they put it right back to the Cardinals. Opportunity for them to take the lead on this possession. 1.45 to go in the second quarter. Vito kicking it out, trying to fire it in for Edwards before he anything else. Offensive foul call. Fans are going to give the, the referees a run for their money there. I mean, very close call nonetheless. And Holyoke will take it the other way. 1.38 to go. We are vastly approaching halftime in this war tonight on Pope Prep. Holyoke trying to fire for two, they can't hit. Mayfield will grab the rebound and restore order in the paint with Vitavelli moving it up the right side to Edwards. Jackson Edwards, big pump, trying to fire from downtown, can't hit. Rebound, we'll get a whistle here before we can do anything else. It'll be Holyoke possession coming in.
Holyoke trying to move it around now. They've got it. 2019 game. One point. Night lead. Nice move from Holyoke. They're going to try to fire. Trying to make it a deep three there. They couldn't hit with Jordan King. Rebound taken in by D'Alessio. D'Alessio quickly moving it up the floor. It's Edwards. Edwards over to D'Alessio. D'Alessio inside. Fake over to Mayfield. Mayfield trying to get the Cardinals the lead. Before we anything else, we've got a jump ball. That'll be Holyoke possession. 48.9 seconds to go. Western Mass. Semi-final. Round two. Winner advances to the final Saturday. Holyoke Knights, we saw them earlier this year. Cardinals just ran up and down the floor with them and beat them at the end of the four quarters. Tonight is a different story. Holyoke coming out here much better on the defensive side. Holyoke looking in. Cardinals trying to make a play. Mayfield will hold it. Yeah, Mayfield will move it the other way along with Reed. TJ Reed holding. He's got Vitavelli. Ryan Vitavelli looking around. Up to D'Alessio. D'Alessio over to Reed. Here's TJ. TJ Reed looking for space. He's got it. Reed will hold. 10 seconds to go in the quarter. Reed looking around. We'll have the last shot of the quarter, maybe. He'll kick out to Vito instead. Vito is right down the money for the Cardinals. And a one, and a two, and a three for Ryan Vito will take us to the end of the second quarter. Coming up, fans, we've got a lot of fun for you. It'll be the halftime report. We'll break down what we saw here for the two quarters and look forward to the next two quarters live exclusively on Pope Prep. Champions play here, back in a flash on Pope Prep. Welcome back here, ladies and gentlemen. We've got a 22-20 score live on Bo Prep. Champions play here. We have fixed our camera issues, which is a good thing for sure. 22-20 game. Tom, Percy, right now, give me your expert thoughts about how that first half went, things you want to see in the second half real quick. I mean, that first half, a lot of back and forth basketball. Obviously, we got a 22-20 game, close game coming in here. Not many fouls from either team. Pope coming in with six. 
fouls between two quarters. Holyoke coming in with three. Three between the two quarters. TJ Reen coming in with seven points total between the two halves, leading Pope for the scoring out of the 22 points. However, on the other side for Holyoke, we got Sean Riviera leading. Leading out of the 20 points, got nine. Are sure to be assisted by Eden Cabrera with five points and Jalen Rodriguez with six points. Well, that first half was a lot of fun. Let me tell you, energy in this building tonight is palpable. The Holyoke Knights fans, the Purple Knights fans, had packed this place completely. Only standing room here. I don't think we've ever been in a situation where we've had only standing room. And tonight, we have officially done something we've never done, which is very awesome to see for sure. So, nonetheless, we'll be back in exactly two minutes. We'll break down what we saw in this first half and really look forward to the second half. We'll give you an even deeper look coming up next on Pope Well, today we had a lot of fun on Pope Prep. We had boys hockey for you this afternoon. Final in that game was 3-1. to one. Pope Francis leading the way there was Jake Terrell scoring on his 18th birthday. How about that? That was a top shelf goal for the Grim Reaper. About a bing, bada boom. Money in the bank, it was. 22-20 is our score here for Pope. Winner of this game advancing to the finals. The stakes felt high in that first half. It'll get even higher in the second half. Pope Francis, they had good ball movement. They got a bit more points on the board. It's that simple. I mean, the first two halves that we've seen with the Amherst and tonight, they, they, the three-point shooting was kind of abysmal. I mean, they could have done a lot better. I think that's what the West is going to hit on. It's the slow starts in these games that's going to come back to be very crucial for them. So when they really need points in that second half, they're going to start to think about the missed opportunities in the first half, and they're going to need, they're going to, need to cover for it in the second half. So we will see how that goes. It'll be a lot of fun nonetheless on Pope Prep. Stay tuned, champs play here. We'll be back in a flash on Pope Prep with the second half of fun basketball. Coming up next.
All right, folks, we are ready to begin in the second half here. A.J. Gonzalez, voice of the Cardinals, alongside with you. Holyoke Knights. Coming back out along with the Pope Francis Cardinals. We are set to begin. Cardinals working from right to left to your screen for the rest of the game. Holyoke Knights will be working from left to right. Vito Belli looking around. He's got it. Vito up to Mayfield. Here's Sam Mayfield. Mayfield up to Anderson. Garrett Anderson trying to fire in for two. He can't hit. Cardinals will look around for it. Try to take a play here, but eventually it'll just be the Holyoke Knights who will look to take it the other way. Knights with possession, trying to move it around now, looking for space, they've got it, they'll try to fire for three, and they hit, going boom style there for Holyoke, and Sean Rivera, Rivera gets it to go from downtown, and the Holyoke Knights take the lead, both teams exchanging the lead here thus far on Pope Prep. Winner go home at this point in the competition. Reed looking in, gets it to go with one hand. TJ Reed puts it in for two, Cardinals will look for some defense the other way. 24-23, the Cardinals grab the lead back. Holyoke, just stuffing around now, maybe even trying to fire for three. That'll be a rim. Rebound taken in by Sam Mayfield. Mayfield will look up the court. Ryan Vitavelli holding it in. Here's Vito, the ginger ninja, kicking it back to Mauer. Jackson Mauer off the mark. Rebound, gobbled in there by Holyoke. And now the Holyoke Knights will look to take it the other way. With possession, they'll look inside. They lose possession, though. It'll be Pope Ball. Now, over to Reed. Here's TJ for two. TJ Reed getting awfully close to 1,000. Awfully close. That's 11 away from 1,000 now. TJ Reed, 11 away from 1,000. Could he break the record tonight? That's the question on Pope Prep. Mayfield holding it in. Cardinals up three. Vito looking around. He's got it. There's Ryan Vitavelli. I'm going to read again. TJ looking for space. He's going to have it. He'll try to fire from three. Can't hit. Hit the high end of the backboard. It'll be Holyoke possession. Don, this one's going to come right down to the end, don't you think? I, I couldn't agree more. But like you said, with their start, Holyoke starting off early, making the threes count. Reminder, folks, to like this content and subscribe to our channel, I'm producing the finest and unique content anywhere on the high school sports scene. So no matter where you are and however you may be listening, live from Springfield, we thank you for tuning in. Holyoke trying to fire from three. They are really getting a hot hand. That's Aiden Cabrera for one, two, three. We have a 26, 26 tie, 5.33 to go in the third quarter. Reed holding in. TJ looking around, trying to fire from downtown. That'll be off the rim. Rebound inside. Mayfield trying to get going. We've got a whistle. It'll be Pope possession. Garrett Anderson will inbound. Anderson over to Vito. Here's Ryan Vitavelli moving it back. Cardinals, nice ball movement. Anderson inside, trying to get going. Can't find it. Rebound gobbled in by Holyoke, and the Knights will take it the other way. 26-26 tie to take the lead on this possession. Holyoke can't capitalize. Cardinals will take it the other way. It's Jackson Mauer. Mauer looking around. He's got a man, Anderson. Garrett Anderson, a rejection, a ferocious rejection by Holyoke. Cardinals coming in for the steal. Now we're trying to get there, and it will head out of bounds. It'll be Holyoke possession. My gracious, what basketball. Edwards will come in for Garrett Anderson. Holyoke Knights inbound. They've got it. Davi Diaz. Diaz moving it around. Sean Rivera. Rivera kicking it back here. Aiden Cabrera. Cabrera into the corner to Diaz. Diaz inside. Looking for room. Jordan King. King kicking it back. Rivera. Rivera back to Diaz. Shot clock at 11. Diaz for two. Trying to float it in, but he can't. And the rebound is taken in by Sam Mayfield. Mayfield over into the corner. Mauer. Jackson Mauer inside, trying to get it to go for two. Mauer just trying to leave it inside. What a heads up play by Jackson Mauer. Could have easily went out on him, but he had the extra effort and the initiative to play it back in and went off of Julio, and he might even extend the possession here for the Pope Cardinals. Redbirds looking to take the lead. 26-26 tie on Pope Prep. 
Reed's got it. Here's TJ. TJ Reed looking inside. Reed's on a fire for two, and he is fouled. Holyoke fans going crazy over that call. Free throws coming in for TJ Reed nonetheless. TJ Reed currently 11 away from 1,000. Make it 10. There'll be nine away here if he can get this free throw. He does. Nine away from 1,000. Holyoke holding it, it's Diaz. Diaz looking around, he's got his man, that was Cabrera. Cabrera working it inside here. That's Rodriguez, Rodriguez back out to Cabrera for three. He's found a hot hand from that distance, but he can't hit here. Rebound taken in by Reed. Here's TJ, TJ, we trying to do a little step back. The shake and bake for two, and eventually he runs out of real estate. Cardinals up two. 28-26 slugfest on Pope Prep. Points hard to come by, but the basketball on the court has been superb. Holyo Castle. With the inside, trying to get something going. And eventually went out of real estate before we can do anything else. We got a whistle here, so we'll just make Pope Francis start back in their own end. Vito Veli will inbound. Here we go. Ryan Vito. Edwards back out to Mauer. Jackson Mauer at the top of the key. Inside. Garrett Anderson twisting and turning in the paint. Can't do much. We got an injured player down here for Julio. And he, he is in some pain here. Hope he's okay. So, Sean Rivera is down for Julio. Hope he's okay. We got to get the training staff here on the court. We'll step aside. Hope Sean's okay. Back in a flash on Pope Prep. Welcome back here, ladies and gentlemen. We got a 28-26 lead for Pope. Sean Rivera is going to be heading back to the locker room. Hope he's okay. There's st star of the showdown. Isn't that the right? Holyoke, we're going to be maybe without him for the rest of the night. I mean, you can see it. He, he wanted to fight through the pain so bad. Star player for Holyoke coming into this game with 199 points. 29 of those being th three-pointers. As he showed early on in this third quarter, what he can do above the arch. That pass actually hit Adam Sarlin over at the scorer's table, former Pope basketball player. I you he wanted to take, take a shot while he was at it. But it'll be Pope possession here. And for Holyoke, that is a brutal injury. Sean Rivera might be done for the night. You'd suspect her in the third late stages of this third quarter. And we may not see Rivera again. Hope he's okay. Mauer looking around now. He's got it. Mauer looking in for Anderson. Anderson leaves it off, Vito just gonna try to fire from three. That will be a rim, rebound taken in by Edwards. Edwards up to Mauer. 
Every point's going to count tonight. Mauer looking for two. Can't hit. Cardinals trying to get the rebound. Went off a lot of feet. And the Holyoke Knights will take it the other way. Cabrera with the shake. The big with the finish. Just was not there. Cardinals will hold it. Idavelli trying to get going, but the pass is picked off by Holyoke. Holyoke, Purple Knights down two. Haven't had points in a while on this game. Holyoke trying to fire from three, and jinx me. I jinx him, and Holyoke gets it to go. That's a three-pointer. That is Aiden Cabrera giving the Holyoke Purple Knights the lead. Coming up, ladies and gentlemen, we continue with more exciting basketball live on Pope Prep. Stay tuned. Champions play here. Back in a flash on Pope Prep. More exciting basketball is on the way. Coming up, playoffs. Who will advance to the final? We find out next. Welcome back, Pope in will inbound. 2.13 to go in this third quarter. Holyoke up one. Cardinals will try to take it in the other way. Reed, looking around, he's got Anderson. Here's Garrett, Garrett trying to do a spin around onto the paint, runs out of real estate, and Holyoke will take it the other way. Holyoke looking in, trying to fire a pass inside, but instead it ends up in the Pope section. That'll be Pope possession coming in here. Dom Percy, give me your thoughts. What's going to be the key takeaway today? Key takeaway. I mean, we've already seen Sean, Sean Revere. Shoot. Jamal Rodriguez going out of this game, injured ankle, hope he's okay. Holyoke's got to step up their game. They want any chance to end this game. Up by one. Cardinals are looking to put pressure on to hopefully go to the finals of Western Mass. Reed but in holds that, it in. He's pull. got it. Here's TJ Reed. Reed looking around. Nice shake and bake here from TJ, but actually, I can hear us. 29 28 score, 117 to go in the third quarter. Anderson, over to Mauer, back to Vito. Ryan Vitavelli for two, trying to get it to go with a sky hook. He couldn't, he'll have to get back up on his feet. 105 to go now in the third quarter. Holyoke trying to fire it for two, and one! Holyoke gets it to go. That's two for them. And one coming in here momentarily. 102 to go in the third quarter. They get the end one. Now the Cardinals are in a bit of a desperate situation here. It's a 32 28 game. 58 seconds to go. It's a steal by Holyoke. It seems like momentum is going the other way now. Holyoke and Diaz looking around. Here's Diaz trying to fire. Trying to fire in for two. Can't. Yeah, it'll head out of bounds and will stay Holyoke possession. Mayfield coming in. Jackson Edwards will hop off. Forty-six point one seconds to go. Thirty-two twenty-eight lead for Holyoke. 
This game has been crazy. Energy in here palpable, Dom. Let me tell you that right now. This game has been nothing but special. Winner of this game heading into Saturday, they will take on the winner of the Agwan Central game. So, Holy Oak trying to fire from three here. They can't get it to go. They'll try to get their inbound, and they do. What a special play that was from Holy Oak, and it will stay. Holy Oak possession. It'll be a foul, too. Man, oh, man. Holy Oak has all the momentum right now. 33.3 seconds to go in the third quarter. The defending champs of the tournament are now at a breaking point. Diaz looking around, trying to move it up the floor. Anderson trying to get back into the defensive ends. It might work out for him. Anderson just keeping the hands in the air. That was smart from Garrett, and he is fouled too. Twenty-three seconds to go in the third quarter. It's a 32-28 lead. For Holyoke. And the Cardinals will look to take it the other way. Mauer. Up to Vito Belli. Ryan Vito. Moving it around. Vito. Up to Mauer again. Jackson Mauer looking around. Mauer. With space. Back out to Ryan Vito Belli. Here's Vito. Looking back. Reed again. TJ with three seconds to go in the corner. He'll lob it up. That's it. Quarter comes to a close. It's a 32-28 lead for the Holyoke Knights. Their fans are into it and going crazy. Cardinals at a breaking point. What's going to happen? We'll find out next on Pope Prep. Fourth quarter, where wins become losses and losses become wins. Pope section on their feet. Holyoke Knights have possession. Close out time for them. Cardinals could use defense. The moments we live for on Pope Prep. Knights looking around. They've got a wide open look at three and they hit. Holyoke Knights get it to go. Energy is all on them now. Cardinals really need a bucket here. Vito up to Maurer. Maurer can't get it to go. Holyoke will get the rebound. Anderson kicks it out. What a sale by Garrett Anderson. Mayfield trying to put it in, and he can't. He can't put it in. Holyoke will take it the other way now. Trying to fire from three. No. Air ball. Rebound. Take it in by TJ Reed. Reed looking. Three for two. No, can't get it to go. Mayfield is there to put it in for two. 35-30, the lead for the Knights. Team's going back and forth now. Fourth quarter. Championship opportunity on the line. Holy Oak Knights holding in possession. They've got it. Looking around here. It's Cabrera. Cabrera looking in, trying to go for two. And we have an offensive foul on the floor. Anderson will inbound. Holy Oak up five. Cardinals trying to come back. Vito over to Reed. TJ Reed to Anderson. Anderson, little jumper, gets it to go. Garrett Anderson for two. It is a three point game. Cardinals going for the steal. Mauer trying to get there. Holy Oak going in the other way. Cardinal fans wanted to travel. It'll head out of bounds. It'll be Holy Oak possession. 
6.32 to go. We told you today that Amherst game was a thriller on Monday. Today might be even better. Cardinals looking for defense. Holy Oak trying to take it for two. We've got a blocking foul called on Ryan Vitavelli. Holy Oak trying to fire in a free throw. They can't get it to go. Pope section was counting him down. Another free throw coming in for them. Jamil Rodriguez at the line trying to make it at least one for two. He does. Back to a two possession lead for the Knights. Big free throw from Rodriguez. Vitavelli will take it the other way. Cardinals down four. Reed has it. Reed. Reed moving it around. Anderson for two, trying to get it to go. Anderson again, looking around. And it's a rejection. A rejection and a half. Wow. Holyoke big sized. They used it there. And we got Anderson and Rodriguez going into it there. They are pushing each other. Referee is going to give them a minute. Mayfield's got it. There's Mayfield inside. Anderson. Garrett Anderson trying to get going, and we've got a foul. Inbound coming in. Vita Belli. Over to Mayfield. Mayfield's got it. Looking around. Shot clock at 30. Plenty of time for Pope. Mauer holding in. Mauer over to Vito Belli. Ryan Vito inside, trying to lay it in for two. Can't get it to go. Mayfield looking for the rebound. I think that foot went out. I thought that foot went out. Holy Oak gonna try to take it the other way. Reed gets back there though. And it will head out of bounds again. We've got a blocking foul. Foul called on Holy Oak. Hope will inbound now. Tensions high in this building. It's a 36-32 game. Vito has it. Cardinals down four. Every possession from this point for Pope is crucial. Mauer has it. Jackson Mauer looking around. Back to Mayfield. Here's Mayfield inside. Garrett Anderson trying to get to it. He does. Garrett Anderson for two, and it's a big one for Pope. Holy Oak going to try to take it the other way now, up two. We are going to get another classic ending tonight on Pope Prep. Cardinals looking for it, trying to make the play. Holyoke looking inside for two. They get it to go. It's Rodriguez getting the job done. Holyoke fans on their feet. Pope fans on their feet. Two iconic teams, a Western Mass clash. Mayfield looking inside. Anderson trying to fire it in for two. two. Tensions falling here. Both sides want a foul. They're not going to get one. Cardinals looking for it. Holyoke trying to make a play inside for a two. Can't get it to go. Holyoke still looking around. Rodriguez for two. Getting it to go for Holyoke. 4.30 to go. Momentum swinging back for the Holyoke Knights. And we've got a timeout by Pope. We'll step aside. 4.25 to go. 40, 34, the lead for Holyoke.
4.25 to go. Fourth quarter. Cardinals looking to go back to back in this Western Mass tournament. At this point though, Holyoke has all the momentum. Reed over to Vito. Ryan Vito from downtown, perfect. Ryan Vitavelli gets it to go. It's a three pointer for the Cardinals. They are back in business, down one possession. Cardinals looking for defense now. Holyoke Knights have the ball. Diaz, Diaz looking inside, heads out of bounds. It'll be Pope Francis' possession. 4.02 to go in the fourth quarter. Cardinals down three. Trying to come back here. Let's go Pope the champ. Loudest it's ever been in my opinion in this gym. Anderson looking, trying to find Mayfield inside. Holyoke trying to take it the other way. It's a steal, a steal. Reed's gonna pot it for two. Reed's gonna pot it for two. TJ Reed gets it to go. Cardinals down down only one. Holyoke looking, they're gonna try to fire from three. Bang, bang. Holyoke gets it to go. Just when you thought the Cardinals were back in it, Holyoke says, no. Both teams going back and forth. Crazy. At Pope, Reed looking inside. We've got a whistle. Sean Rivera, we thought he wasn't going to return. He is back on the floor for the Holyoke Purple Knights. He is making an impact. Reed is at the line here. Reed trying to make it at least a one for two here, and he misses both of them. He missed both of them. Wow, that could swing the game. Man, oh man, that was an instant opportunity for points for Mr. Reed, but he can't cash in. Meanwhile, the other way, Holyoke hits a three. They get it to go. It's Sean Rivera. You thought he was done. He is back. He is back for more. Vito, out to Mauer. Jackson Mauer for three, off the mark. Rebound kicked in, Reed for three. Bang, bang, TJ Reed. It's it to go for Pope Francis. It's a 46-42 game. My gracious, I'm gonna have a heart attack. Four away from 1,000 now is Reed. Cardinals looking for defense. Diaz, looking around, he's got it. Diaz, Rodriguez. Rodriguez, taking it back here. It's Rivera. Rivera holding it in, shot clock at 10. 2.22 to go. Rivera to Diaz. Diaz looking inside for the else, but he got a blocking foul on Pope. Blocking foul called on the Cardinals. Inbound coming in for Rivera and Holyoke. Up four. We've got a timeout taken. We'll step aside. 2.18 to go. Drama time on Pope Prep. Two eighteen to go, fourth quarter. 46-42, the lead for the Knights. Trying to get dagger time going for them. Rivera inbounds, Cabrera. Rivera to Cabrera. 
over Rodriguez for two. Gets it to go. Rodriguez puts it in. It's a six-point lead for the Purple Knights. Cardinals are going to go in the other way. Vito gets it to go. Ryan Vitavelli makes it a 48-44 game. Cardinals looking for defense. Holy Oak Knights trying to get going the other way. They've got it looking inside. Anderson trying to get the steal. Moves over to Mayfield. We've got a timeout called by Pope. 149 to go. Fourth quarter. We'll step aside once more. Cardinals will inbound. Down four. 149 to go in this game. What an ending we're going to have on Pope Prep. Every basket down crucial. If I'm Delesio, I am putting the ball into the hands of my best players, letting Reed and Vito decide the outcome. Vito's got it. Ryan Vito looking inside. Mayfield for two. He tried to go on his head. He couldn't. Hold him. We'll take it the other way now. Huge point in the game. It is dagger time for them. Holio looking in, trying to fire for two. Offensive foul. Offensive foul called on Rivera. The Cardinals will take it the other way. 123 to go. It is a four-point lead for Holyoke. Vito taking it the other way. He's got it. Maya Vito looking for an outlet again. If I am Delesio, let the best players decide my game. Vitavelli's going to take it. Vito back out to Anderson. Anderson to Mauer. Jackson Mauer, 108 to go. Fourth quarter, Cardinals down four. Anderson inside. Anderson trying to go. He does. Darren Anderson makes it a one-possession game. Diaz quickly trying to take it the other way. Diaz looking around, trying to create space. He does. Holio. Going to let the clock wind down. Less than a minute to go. Energy palpable. Cabrera has it. Trying to go right to the paint. Can't put it in. Rodriguez is fouled. 38.4 seconds on the clock. Rodriguez at the line. Crucial free throws come out to come in and come out shortly. Thirty-eight point four seconds on the clock now. Let's see if they make any changes. They're going to give them forty-two point two, forty-two point two seconds to work with now. Rodriguez at the line, two free throws huge. Has the opportunity if he hits both to make it a two possession game. Rodriguez, first one, right down the money and that is big. And makes it a three point game. And now this one, the all important one, make it a two possession game. Rodriguez, essentially a chance to send his team off into the final. Rodriguez, no, he doesn't get it to go, but it's a steal, look out. Holyo trying to get there, Anderson will restore order, and the Cardinals will take it the other way. Reed has it, Reed, over to Vito, Ryan Vito from downtown, bang, bang, Ryan Vito. 
now for three, 28.8 seconds to go. That's a three, that's a three. No, it's a two, it's a two, it's a two. They're gonna count it as a two. That is a three all day long. They are putting it in as a two. If we can get a replay of that. A two on the board. There is a two on the board. We thought for sure it'd be a three. It is a two. Wow. My gracious. Man, oh man. You'd think, I thought that was a three for sure. We could see all the way from here. His foot was well past the line over the arch. Was his foot on the line? That's I mean, the question. Apparently to the refs, they thought it was on the line, but from what we saw here at court level off on the sidelines, well a three to us. Awfully close. This is how you hate to see your end, your game end, but down by one point. Cardinals are gonna need a defensive stand to keep their Western Mass hopes alive. Hopes of going back to back. Hopes of rewriting history. 28.8 seconds to go. It's a 49-48 game. Holy Oaks trying to ice it here. Ball is in their hands. Their fate is essentially in their hands. Holy Oak inbounding. They'll look up the floor. Diaz up top. He's got a man, Rivera. Rivera looking in and we have a foul. Foul called on Holyoke. Or excuse me, the foul called on Pope. My goodness. Pope not in the bonus yet. That's their fourth team foul of the quarter. Not in the bonus. Rivera looking in. He's got his man. Trying to find Diaz. That will put them at five fouls. They just want the clock to come down and stay right there at 20.8. That'd be a comfortable number for them. Diaz at the line, shooting free throws, first one good, big one, making it a two-point lead for Holyoke. Was Ryan Vitavelli's foot on the line? That's a question that'll reign supreme for a long time. Anderson holds it in here. Cardinals want a timeout. They'll get it with 17.5 seconds to go. Stay tuned. Champions play here. Uh, Ultimate Decider coming up next live on Pope Prep. Seventeen and a half seconds to go. 50-48 game. This one's gonna come right down to the end tonight on Pope Prep. It'll be Pope possession. Wow, what an ending. Could you ask for anything better than this? 50-48. The lead for Holyoke. Cardinals will inbound. Seventeen and a half seconds to go. Vito has the opportunity. The Cardinals down two. Does he go for two or try to ice the game? Anderson inside. Anderson is fouled. And Garrett Anderson will be heading to the line to shoot two. To tie the game, in theory, if he can hit both of these free throws. 
and maybe send it to overtime. Noise in here loud. Garrett Anderson, biggest free throws of his life. First one, good for Garrett. The two biggest free throws of Garrett Anderson's career coming right here. The biggest one now. If he doesn't hit this, it is anarchy for Holyoke. Free throw is good for Garrett. He ties the game. Ties it with eight seconds to go. Holyoke trying to do something the other way. Before we can do that, we've got a timeout taken. We'll step aside. 7.9 seconds to go. It's a 50 50 tie. Stay tuned. Champions play here. Could you ask for anything better than this? I know I can. 50 50 tie. Coming up, we've got more basketball next on Pope Prep. Eight point six seconds to go. Fifty fifty time. What more could you ask for? Winner of this game heading to the final. Holy Oakle inbound. Diaz pass tip. That'll be pump ball. That'll be pump ball. What a mistake! What a mistake from Holy Oak. Wow. Big mistake from Holy Oak. They could not afford, that was the one thing they couldn't do, and they did it. Cardinals will inbound now. Anderson looking, Vito, Mayfield for two to maybe win the game. No, can't get it home. Vito can, no, not either. And we're heading to overtime. Shot does not count from Vito Belli. Overtime, it will be on Pope Prep. Wow. Overtime. Winner advances to the final. Loser goes home in shambles. We will find out next who is going to win. What a game. A classic at Pope Francis. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. A reminder to like this content. Subscribe to our channel. We're producing the finest unique content anywhere on the high school sports scene. So no matter where you are and however you may be listening, we thank you for tuning in. It is overtime on Pope Prep. 50-50 time. What more could you ask for on Pope Prep? Both teams about to break their huddle. Fifty fifty time. Here we go. The moment these Cardinals have looked for. On the floor for them, it's going to be Mayfield, Vitavelli, Anderson, Reed, and Mauer. Game of the year on Poe Prep. Glad you could be with us. This is now officially our best game we have ever done in terms of viewership for a basketball game. We have 245 live watching right now. We thank you for tuning in at home. And it'll head out of bounds, off the tip, which means it will be Pope possession. 3.57 in this overtime. It's a four minute overtime. Extra period, extra quarter on Pope Prep, however you want to call it. One will go home in shambles. One team will be heading off to the final. Vita Valley says, see you later. I'm taking it to the paint. 
Lion Vitabelli gets it to go. It's a 52-50 lead for Pope. Cardinals looking for defense. Mallard trying to get there. Garrett Anderson, huge free throws near that end of that fourth quarter, but nothing he could do there. We've got a whistle coming in. Rodriguez hits the two, and we've got a player coming off. I believe that is Cabrera. Yep, Aiden Cabrera will hop off the floor. 52-52 game. He ties it up. On an injury timeout here. Teams will stop momentarily. Chauncey Ruiz is into the game for Holyoke. 3.20 to go in overtime. Vito has it. Vito looking. Finds Mauer. Jackson Mauer looking around. Over to Reed. Reed calling a shot. Reed looking. He's got Vito right near me and you. Vito for three. Can't get it to go. Holy Uncle taking the rebound and trying to work the other way. They got it. Holy Oak with space. Trying to create it. They do. Nice ball movement from the Knights. Tie game, 52 apiece, 2.50 to go, fourth quarter. Reed looking for the defense, shot clock at 15, it's Rivera, Rivera kicking it around, Holyoke trying to fire from three, they can't hit, Reed looking for a rebound, he'll come away with it. And coming up the floor fast with speed and steam is Reed, TJ looking for space, he's gonna have it, Reed looking around, TJ, TJ backs to Ryan Vitavelli, Vito, Trying to find an outlet. Vito is in a hard place here. That could have been a travel. Vito doesn't get called for it. Vito will try to get it on the floor. Anderson will try to get there too. And we've got a timeout taken by Pope. Timeout for Pope. 52-52. Fourth quarter. 2.18 to go in overtime. Two eighteen to go, overtime. Again, folks, we'd like to thank you at home. We have broken a record for a basketball game, 245 viewers at one time. Thank you. Vitavelli holding in now. Anderson has it. Overtime to advance the Class A Western Mass Championship this Saturday. Vitavelli has it inside. Mayfield, Sam Mayfield trying to get going. Reed has it. Here's TJ, shot clock at 23. Reed going in, trying to fire for two, can't hit. Rebound, Anderson looking for it. Vita Belli down there too, dog fight for it. Fans want to travel, they're not gonna get it. It heads out of bounds, another mistake from Sean Rivera. Rivera beside himself in the paint right now. He can't believe it. Cardinals have to capitalize. 52-52 game, 150 to go tonight in overtime. Tie game, Reed trying to take it to the paint. TJ gets it to go. TJ Reed for two, maybe the biggest two. He's hit when it's time at Pope. He is now two away from a thousand as well. Reed looking for defense. Holio trying to take it the other way. Down two, 125 to go in overtime. Diaz, look out, we've got a timeout taken. They have to take it. Timeout taken, 124 to go. We are going to stay with you. We aren't going to pause here in this stage in overtime. We are going to stay with you. Don Percy, give me your immediate thoughts right off the bat here. I mean, we've had a lot of back and forth basketball in this game, but overtime basketball might be the most energetic part throughout this game that we've seen so far. Back and forth. Very, very little mistake. I mean, we're, talk we're talking every mistake gets capitalized on if that happens. Close game here, not reaching out with without um, six-point lead. 
today. What an ending we're going to get here, Don Percy. This is going to be crazy, let me tell you. You know, I used to live for these games when I was a young kid doing this for us, this kind of stuff. Let me tell you, you're getting a dandy year one. Wish I had that kind of opportunity year one, let me tell you. I mean, these are, the, these are the games we live for right here. Overtime, two-point games, do or die. Why we work all winter long to get it going for you on Pope Prep. Now five seconds until the players head back out of the courts. Pope players are ready to go. Up two. Overtime. Winner advances to the championship. Loser heads home quiet. Holyoke breaking out of the timeout too. Holyoke inbounds off the timeout. It's Rivera. After that big mistake, passing it out of bounds, it led to the read two. Now, Pope will control their own destiny, trying to play defense up two with 120 to go. Holio working inside, trying to get a play going here. Cardinals looking for it. Mauer trying to get there and make the play. Holyoke still in possession. It's Cabrera. Cabrera kicking it out. Diaz has an open look at three. He has it. Timeout, Holyoke. What a three. Bang. He gets it to go. Diaz from downtown. 107 to go in overtime. Holyoke has the lead again. Wow. Davi Diaz. A clutch three. Definition of clutch right there from Diaz. Wow. Timeout taken by Holyoke. Man, oh man, what drama. I mean, we talked about early on capitalizing on the threes. But Holyoke mostly coming to life with the, making the three points. First and second quarter start off a little shaky. As the game went on through the third and fourth quarters, they've developed a lot more. Starting to make those threes that count. Crazy ending on Pope Prep. Cardinals down one. It'll be their ball out of its Holyoke timeout. Boiling point in this game. Cardinals, defending champions of this tournament. It could end their back-to-back -back quest right here. 107 to go. 55-54, the lead for the Knights. Anderson will inbound. Here we go. Vitavelli has it. Here's Vito. Mayan and Vitavelli looking around. The Mauer goes. Here's Jackson Mauer inside. Anderson. Garrett Anderson looking to get for two. No, can't get it. Rebound. Vitavelli trying to get it to go. He is fouled. Lion Vitavelli will be heading to the line for three throws. It'll be two shots for him. Vitavelli, big free throw. First one, good. Gets it to go. We are back and tied up. Even Steven on Pope Prep. Second free throw coming in for Vito. He gets it to go. Ryan Vito gives the Cardinals the lead. Less than a minute to go. Drama palpable. Western Mass Classic tonight on Pope Prep. Cabrera has it for Holio. Moving to the round. Diaz. Diaz, shot clock at 18, 30 seconds to go in overtime. That could have been a travel, and they are not going to get it. Look out here, Rodriguez trying to stub it off, and that is a foul. Where is the travel? Fans outraged, and they didn't get a travel there. Now it will be free throws for Holyoke with 27.2 seconds to go with an opportunity to take the lead. Rodriguez will shoot. Pope section will do their best to blow the roof off of this place to make sure that Rodriguez does not hit both of these free throws. 27.2 seconds to go in overtime. Jackson Edwards will come on. Interesting choice. Ryan Vitavelli is taking a seat. Must be out of gas at this point. 
Rodriguez free throw. First one is good. We are tied up, 56 apiece. This free throw right here can give Holyoke the lead. Rodriguez, a huge free throw. 27.2 seconds to go. Cardinal section gonna get as loud as they possibly can. Free throw coming in, he gets it to go, and it's a one point Holyoke lead. Cardinals inbound, here we go. Game could be decided right here. Everyone on their feet here at Pope. Reed, looking for it, he's got it. Reed, looking around, trying to find his shot. Edwards will try a three, bang, bang! Jackson Edwards gets it to go. Cardinals are up. They look around. Julio trying to take it the other way. It's going to come down to the end. Three seconds to go. They'll fire around. Diaz last shot. No, that's it. Pope is heading to the next round. Pope Francis is heading to the next round. Van Storm the court. Are you kidding? Wow. Jackson Edwards calls game. Jackson Edwards calls game. Jackson Edwards calls game. My gracious. Wow. It's a final. Wow. And the fans will head out too. Oh my gracious. Jackson Edwards with the biggest three of his young career. Unbelievable. I am speechless. Jackson Edwards. I thought that was going to be the biggest mistake for him if he missed it. He gets it to go from downtown and sends the Holyoke fans home quiet. What an ending. Oh, my gracious. And I forgot to play the all I do is win song. Tune it up for me. The Cardinals. Hang on to win it. Man, what an ending. I think we have a new candidate for the best game that I have ever done as a member of Pope Prep Productions. What an ending. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. The Cardinals hung on tonight to win this game. That might be the best game I have ever seen. I mean, you want to talk about clutching up. Flat, dying moment of overtime. Jackson Edwards fade away three. Y you just can't get better than that. He sends the Cardinals to the final round of the Western Mass Tournament where he where they will face the winner of Agwam Central. And man oh man, was this game Jackson, what an ending. Jackson Edwards, the man that has come on this year and has played inspirational basketball for Pope Francis. Gets it to go. Biggest three-pointer of his life. It is good for Pope Francis. And the Cardinals are heading to the final and a chance to repeat as champions of Western Massachusetts. They will now take on the winner of the Central Aguan game. There will be a final this week. Again, we remind you to check the Pope Francis Prep website and the athletics page for that. We also, from all of us at Pope Prep Productions, would like to thank you for breaking a record, a new for how total consecutive viewers for one game of boys basketball 245 at one time thank you so much for being a part of this great night of basketball the Pope Francis Cardinals are heading to the final Jeff, Don Percy, any last thoughts my friend? I mean both, both teams Polio has absolutely nothing to be ashamed of both teams come in this majority of the game within one, two, or three points Loyal put left all their effort on the board. Pope wanted it more tonight. Jackson, great game, fadeaway three in the dying moments of all time. I mean, what an ending. You can't ask for more. I think I almost had an heart attack, and I'm not even being facetious this time. I Sometimes I faked heart attacks. I threw my hat down and dropped to both of my knees. That's the first time that has ever happened in the year at Pope Francis. What a game. What an ending. Congratulations to the Cardinals. They will now have their hardest task of the season ahead of them. They will take on the Central Aguam winner. 
And let me tell you, it'll be the final for the ages, especially if it is Central. We will get the battle that a lot of people, the pundits in the Western Mass basketball community, predicted as the matchup we would see for the Class A title. That will be very fun to see for sure. We hope we can get it. If I thought Adwa has had a very good year as well, we would love to see the Brownies in the championship game. But let me tell you, Pope Central, that is the game we have wanted for years. We might finally get it in the final of Western Mass for the Cardinals to go back to back. Oh, man. I've got the chills after that one. Fans, thank you so much for tuning in tonight. For Mr. Dale Jeffrey, for Matthew Zender, for Dominic Percy, the future voice of the Cardinals, I'm A.J. Gonzalez. Hello, I said the Pope Francis Cardinals, saying so long from Springfield. Our final, 59-57, Cardinals win the game of the year. So long from Springfield. We will see you this weekend for the final.